Hello and welcome to Interactive CAD. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to draw the Apple logo. And the technique I've opted to show you today on how to draw it is by using points and inserting points um, using a text file. So I've created these two files. Um, I will put um, the coordinates required in the description for the video so you can copy uh, and create these points files for yourself if you want to have a go at creating the Apple logo in SolidWorks. Um, so the format, if you ever need to insert points into SolidWorks, is literally X, comma, Y, comma, Z. And that's it. And then your next line, X for the next point is X, Y, Z, all split up by commas. Um, and you need a, a separate file for each curve. Um, so this points file that I've created here is for the apple, main part of the apple, and this is for the points two is for the apple leaf. Um, so the, how you insert these points into SolidWorks is go up to curves and you go curve through X, Y, Z points and click browse. Now it always comes up as a default with SolidWorks um, curve files, but we want text files. And if I click points for the main body of the apple, press OK. I'm just go face on with that. As you can see, it's um, it's plotted the points and created a curve round all those points that, that I did. And then if I go back to curves again, um, insert curve through X, Y, Z points again, but browse and click, go to text files and click points two. OK. Okay, so from there, I've got two curves now that I can use as references in sketches. So if I go to the front plane and click sketch, and now I'm going to convert entities of the two curves and take that and literally just extrude that. Uh, the 25 though. And there you have it a very simple, easy way uh, to to draw quite a complex shape um, is using point, uh, coordinate systems and using points and using the um, curve through XYZ points tool. I hope you found this video interesting and helpful. I'll put the point um, cl cloud data, like I said, in the description for the video. If you've got any questions, please leave it in the comments. And please, if you've enjoyed it, uh, please subscribe to my channel. And thanks for watching.